if anybody, any man or woman, if they are after your marriage, your life, your children, your business, do this first, drink this, and you will become untouchable. No man can harm you. No woman can harm you. No force can harm you. Drink this and be untouchable. Be indestructible. Your life will change. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you have not. Make sure you turn on the bell notification beside the subscribe button to get updates. On this channel, I share with you powerful spiritual tips that would help you greatly. So all you need is to subscribe and make sure you turn on the bell. Share this video with your friends. So if anyone is after your life, after your business, after your marriage, whether physically or spiritually, you do this. There are some people, they are after your life. Physically, you know that they are after your life. You know that they are always planning to fight you. They are always planning to destroy you. Of course, as humans, we all have people who want us down, who want our sources down. But I'm not saying you should start suspecting, suspecting your neighbors, suspecting your colleague. No, but there are enemies. Do not try to harm anybody. Instead, protect yourself. When you protect yourself, whoever they are, whoever they are, they will run far from you. They will never hurt you. So all you need is to get a glass of water. A glass of water. Do this prayer any time of the day. You're going to do this in different cups and give to your children also to drink. All members of your household, they should drink it just once. And nothing will harm them. This works a lot. The first thing you will get is salt. Salt is one powerful natural products from God. Okay? Salt is powerful. Salt is powerful. Elisha used salt in 2 Kings 2 verse 20 to heal the land. So all you need is to add a pinch of salt like this. Just a pinch, not so much because you are going to drink this. So salt is not so heavy to drink too much, to take too much, okay? So add it in the water. You have added salt. But we are not done yet. You are also going to get anointing oil. This is anointing oil. It is olive oil, but after you pray on this, it becomes anointing oil. So try to bless your oil. Either you go to church and give this to your pastor, your bishop, to pray on it, to pray on this and bless it, or you can pray on this yourself. Oh Lord, bless this oil. Send your blessing. Rest your power on Paul. Rest your power upon this oil in the name of Jesus. I soak this oil with the blood of Jesus. Oh Lord, bless this oil. Oh Lord, bless this oil. You open it and begin to pray. This oil is blessed in the name of Jesus Christ. This oil is blessed in the name of Jesus Christ. That as I use this, no evil will come to me. That as I use this, no power can attack me. That as I use this, there will be protection. Oh Lord, make this oil powerful with your protection, with your blessing. So when you are done, you get your Bible, you read a powerful scripture on this. If you are going to bless an oil yourself, you have to open it, pray on it, and get your Bible. Get your Bible. You must do this to bless your oil yourself or, or give it to an ordained man or woman of God, a pastor or a priest. But if you are doing this yourself, you open to this psalm, either Psalm 23, or Psalm 91, or even Psalm 7, Psalm 20, you read on it and pray on this and the oil becomes blessed. So add this inside. Anointing breaks the yoke. Anointing breaks the yoke. When you are anointed, no evil can come close to you. Just know that. That oil of protection will be on you. Okay? Now we have salt water and anointing oil. You can see that the oil is on top. Look at it. Oil can never mix up with water. Oh Lord, as this oil is separated from this water, separate all my enemies from me in the name of Jesus. Amen. Oh Lord, as this oil is separated from this water, separate all my enemies from me 
in the name of Jesus. Amen. Oh Lord, as this oil is separated from this water, separate all my enemies from me and my family members in the name of Jesus. Amen. Oh Lord, as I drink this, I will become indestructible. Oh Lord, as I drink this, no harm will come to me in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, bless this. Send forth your protection. Send forth your protection. Oh Lord, protect me and my family members. No evil shall come near us. Every man or woman, every evil personality, after my marriage, after my children, after my life, after my finance, after my business, after my words, that are planning to bring pain to us, oh Lord, as we drink this, they will run far from us. They will see the blood of Jesus and run far from us. In the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, as we drink this, we are protected with the blood of Jesus. As we drink this, we are protected with the blood of Jesus. As we drink this, we are protected with the blood of Jesus. No evil shall come to me. No evil shall come near my family. In the name of Jesus. Amen. So when you are done, pray on this. You plead the blood of Jesus Christ several times. I plead the blood of Jesus Christ. Amen. I pray the blood of Jesus Christ. Amen. Do this several times and get your Bible. Open to Psalm 91. Psalm 91, where are you? Can you read? I'm going to read the first, second verse for you. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High God shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say to the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress. My God in him will I trust. Surely he shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowler and from the noisome pestilence. He shall cover thee with his feathers and under his wings shall thou trust. His trust shall be their shield and buckler. Thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that flieth by day, nor for the pestilence that walketh in darkness nor for the destruction that wasted at no day. So I stopped at verse 6. Read the whole of Psalm 91, okay? When you are done, oh Lord, I'm under your protection. Cover me with your wings. Cover my family with your wings. We are under your shelter. No evil shall come near us. No evil shall come near us in the name of Jesus. When you are doing this, use the words in the Bible to pray. Oh Lord, you are my refuge. You are my fortress. Oh Lord, be our refuge. Be our fortress. Be our protection. Be our defense. Be our protection. Oh Lord, save us from all our enemies. Save my children. Save my family. Save my business. Separate us from every evil plan of the enemies. No arrow shall hurt us. No evil shall come close to us. In the name of Jesus, amen. We are indestructible. We are unstoppable in Jesus' name. Amen. When you are done, you drink part of this. Then you use whatever is left. You pour on your face. Then leave it on your face for about 30 minutes. Then go and take your bath. And that is it. Do that for your children also. Do it for your children. The way I do this is that I get a bigger jug or big cup or big bowl. Put in much water. Then add Tiny salt. Then when you are done, you get different cups and share it. You should all drink it and pour on their faces. And they are protected. They have the mark of Jesus Christ. You have the mark of Jesus Christ. No evil shall come near you. If they try, they will die. If they try to hurt you, they will die. If they try to come for your marriage, if they try to stop your blessing, if they try to attack your family, if they try to stop your growth, they will die. They will not succeed, no matter what they plan. Everything that concerns you is protected in the name of Jesus. Amen. Do this just once and believe in God. And see miracle. Your enemies will see you and run. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you have not. Turn on the bell notification to always get updates.